Hi everybody, this is Tina. And today's video is going to be about doing sashes and borders with your Panavision. All right, so the first step that we need to do is we're going to go into File. We're going to select New Project. And as you can see here, you have the width and then you have the depth. So what we want to do is we want to change the width of the border. Now, our plus and our minuses will change the first two numbers, but it will not do anything with the last two numbers. So when we click on this, it will bring up our keypad and the keypad will only go down to 25. Otherwise you get an error message. So we want to do 25.95. We want our sash, we want to cover 3.95 of our sash. So we're going to do 95 so we can get those last two numbers. We're going to hit OK. And then we're going to use the minus key to bring us down to 3.95. Just like that. All right. And then let's say our depth, we want it to be 60. There we go. Now when I hit accept, it's going to bring up my sash that we just did. All right, so it's 3.95 across and then 60 going down. Now, if we want to do a border, it's going to be the same way. We're going to bring in new project and let's say the width of our border going across, let's say it's the top border. Our top border is 60. And then let's say it's an eight inch border. It's kind of big, but that's okay. So we're gonna to go to 25 point, oh, let's say 80. We're going to hit OK. So we have 25.80. We want to bring that down to 7. So we'll cover 7.80 of that border with an 8 inch border. And we hit accept. And then we have to bring it down. There we go. Just like that. Now, the biggest thing that I can tell you right now, after I did the first video, I got locked out of my system with an error code. That is because if you go into settings and you hit quilt size, I now have a depth of my quilt at 7.80. Whenever you are finished with your sash or your border, you need to go into settings just like this, we're gonna go back into settings, go down to quilt size, and you need to change this so that it says 12. All right, otherwise, once you turn off your Panavision, you could end up getting locked out because the code that's in Panavision is set at 12, not below that. So make sure that you, when you finish, you go back into your quilt size and you change whichever number is below 12 back up to 12. All right, so that's it for today. Those are your sashings and your borders. If you could, please like or comment. I appreciate the feedback and I hope you have a great day quilting. And remember, practice, practice, practice your Panavision.